Hey everyone, my name is Nathan Cooper and welcome back to SIS Film Breakdowns. The next episode in our video series features Fresno State left guard Natani Muti. His career at Fresno State was a bit of a roller coaster due to injury. He redshirted and missed his entire freshman season with an Achilles injury. After starting all 14 games in 2017, he ruptured his Achilles after just two games in 2018 and then suffered a foot injury in 2019, limiting him to just the first three games. At the combine, he measured in at six feet, two and seven eighths inches, 315 pounds. Being injured, he wasn't able to do much while in Indy, but he did do the bench press and didn't disappoint, leading all participants with 44 reps. We're going to watch and break down some of his plays in two of the games he played in this year against USC and Minnesota. We're first going to take a look at a couple of plays of him as a pass blocker. The first play comes from the Minnesota game. At the snap of the ball, we can see how quick he gets his hands up, does a great job of getting them into the chest of the defender. He keeps a good wide base with a strong anchor and uses his quick feet to mirror the defender's movements to stay in front of him for the play. Next play comes against USC. USC is going to stunt up front. The three technique is going to rush up the field here to his outside shoulder and then the edge is going to come up and then dip underneath. At the snap, Muti does a great job by quickly recognizing it, getting hands on the first man and then redirecting quickly with power to the edge looping under. Not only is he able to get hands on, but he's able to control the defender and use his power for lower half to drive him away from the pocket. As you can see in this graphic, he only blew two blocks on pass plays in the five games he played over the last two seasons, resulting in just a 1.3% blown block rate. Now we're going to watch him in the run game. Against Minnesota here, he's going to pull to the right and get upfield out in front of the quarterback on this inverted veer look with the receiver in motion. Muti does a great job pulling quickly, getting to the second level, and making the block. He takes a good angle, comes in under control, and takes advantage of the linebacker being off balance. And not only does he make his block, but he plays with the nasty side and finishes through the whistle. The next play comes from the USC game. This is going to be a zone read look from the quarterback. And at the snap of the ball, he does a good job comboing up to the second level under control against a smaller, more agile defender. But we can see that his feet sort of get a little bit stuck in the ground which causes him to lunge a little bit and bend a bit at the waist. And that's something that he'll actually do a little bit too often whenever you watch him throughout games. The last two plays come against Minnesota. This one is duo blocking with a counter stunt by the back of the backfield. Minnesota is going to run a stunt up front. At the snap of the ball, he takes number 90 and sees number 34 sliding underneath. And you can see here, quickly discards 90, picks up 34. Not only does he pick him up, but he comes in with good extension and strength, working and staying with him a good 7 to 8 yards down the field. The last play we're going to take a look at will be a stretch play to the right, going away from Muti. He has a one technique lined up inside him, and at the snap of the ball, he does a great job reaching to get underneath the one tech. This is a really tough play for a guard to have to make but he does a great job using his quick feet to get in position. And once he latches on, he still does a great job working and getting completely between his man and the ball. And once he gets there, he's not satisfied as he shows his nasty side again, finishing his man to the ground. You can see in this graphic that in 2019, ball carriers on zone runs to Muti's gap when he was on the field were able to gain a half yard more on average before first contact as compared to the other left guards when he wasn't on the field and injured the rest of the season. Muti is a big strong guard who has all the makings to be an impact player at the next level, assuming he can stay healthy. When he plays, he's effective, but being available and able to stay on the field is something we will have to wait and see about. Make sure to go get the SIS Football Rookie Handbook or register for a free trial on the SIS Data Hub to see all of these stats and more for every player and also tune in each week to the Off the Charts podcast. Thanks for watching SIS Film Breakdowns.